kidding around is a specialty toy store in New York City. You won't find any of this stuff you in won't, Target, you won't find Walmart. It. No. Owner no. Paul Nippa yeah. says today is his busiest day of the year. Within the last month, what, what, what have your sales been? They're up from last year about 5.5%, but uh, oh, some of that is the influence of the early Hanukkah. He's doing better than most retailers. ShopperTrack, which monitors consumer behavior nationwide, predicted holiday sales growth of 3.3%. They just cut it to 2.5%. Foot traffic growth has been solid, but people are still very tight with their purse strings. Retail analyst Craig Johnson noticed a slowdown immediately after Thanksgiving doorbusters sold out. Up and down the spectrum, uh, from luxury to mid-tier to value, there's a lot of weakness. It's not terrible growth, but it's tepid, sluggish growth at best. Retailers say consumer enthusiasm has been dampened by the images from Newtown and the threat of higher taxes if Washington fails to cut a budget deal. Anytime you take uh, uh, income out of the consumer's pocket, you're going to reduce consumer activity and reduce retail spending. So retailers are offering steep discounts to salvage the season. Teen store Aeropostal is offering 60% off on its website. Children's Place, a clothing chain, is offering up to 75% off. When the kids need toys, the kids need toys. When you need a present, you need a present. What Nippus really needs is a big sales day. Michelle Miller, CBS News, New York.